sorry about that. It was a toll-free call. Yes, I hate it when I get calls from them. Okay. Let's keep going. Over here. Nope, not there. Just connect it to each corresponding button. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five. Now, if you want to make it more confusing, so that you have to go like three, four, one, five, two, then all you have to do is just simply switch the order the RS neural matches are connected. That's all you have to do. Cool, now time to test it. Now when we test it, all we have to do is just walk on down, click every single button, except the enter button. We go check this RS Norlatch. It should be tripped just like it is. All the currents are now over here, all the currents on this are off, so we know all the current is reaching and we've done a good job so far. And to reset it, just hit this first one, and they all reset. So if you if you think you know the right answer and you hit the right one first, you know what? Let's make that reset button. Here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna take the button. I'm not gonna put a sign on it or anything because we don't really need to. And what we're going to do is simply take it like so. All the way across. Just like this. Not like that. And put the last block there. Connect the redstone in. And take it on back. Now let's just test it out. Let's hit one. Okay, that torch is on. Let's hit that button. And the torch is now off. Okay, reset button is hooked up. Now what we need to do is hook up the enter button and such. What we're going to do is hook up this last, the last number. It's going to come this way, off the one that's off. going to come over all this. And it's going to split up into two different paths. One path is death. The other path opens the door. So, Let's say you get it right first. We're going to go this way for if you get it right. What we're going to do is basically hook it up into an AND gate. Simple. You've all seen my AND gate video. And what that's going to look like is this.
torches off. Because two positives equal negative, and the negative is showed in the torch. Next thing we're going to do is hook up the enter button. So now if the enter button and all the buttons are pressed, the AND gate will deactivate. However, this is going to go and trip an RS Norlatch. We're not done with those. Let me turn that one off. That one has to be off. And this one has to be on. And basically, Let's make a wall over here. No. Yeah, over here. <coughs> Ow. There's the wall. One, two, three, four, five, enter. Let's see what happened. Apparently I did not hit the button four correctly. Five. Enter. There is now current going in here. Ah, uh, that's why. Okay, 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 okay. It doesn't reach. That's the problem. That's just a simple task of putting a repeater where it does reach. Now that torch goes off, as you just saw. And you click the enter button, wash the RS no latch, it trips. Isn't that nifty? That, that, that nifty. So. Now let's hit the reset button. RS no latch should be back to normal. Nah, of course not. That's because it's an RS no latch. And it'll only go back to normal if it is hooked up. And that is can be done by doing this. Basically, we are going to be putting on a loop system. So that when this activates, it comes back around in a circle and hits it again. So that it then switches. This is for um, the door, like I'm going to be making a piston door. So this will just delay the time the piston is open, the doors are open. Or no last switches. Now. Now that we have if you succeed part done. Time to do the part where if you die you're screwed. Okay. This is also going to be hooked up to an AND gate. However, the hookup is going to be a little bit different. Okay, let's set this up. One, two, three. One, two, three.
Gallery Bop. Okay. Coming in from over there. Let's do that. And go this way. Okay, that's off. Now, when you correctly activate the sequence, there will be a pulse that goes in here. Not a pulse, a current. The current will then deactivate this part of the AND gate, and it will deactivate this torch, which will then activate this torch. That way, when you click the ENTER button, it will send a current to this AND gate and this AND gate. But since this AND gate is not complete anymore, you will not get punished. 